Hey everyone, Daniel Fusco here. Welcome to today's two minute message. A lot of people have visions for what they think your life should be. I like to call these competing visions where there's a competition for who are you supposed to be? But I wanna tell you that there's one vision for your life that needs to trump all other visions and that is God's vision for your life. I like to say it this way, we need to be fierce about God's vision for our lives because there are competing visions. There are lots of people who think you're supposed to be lots of different ways and they encourage you with all that they can to fulfill their vision for your life. But then there's God's vision. Now, what's interesting about God's vision? Everyone is loud except for God's vision because God speaks to us in a still small voice. Sure, he speaks boldly in his word, but God's prompts in our hearts by the spirit are often in a very still small voice. And so in a loud world with competing visions, people screaming in your ear and into your heart, this is who I want you to be. There's that still small voice of God who says, this is who I created you to be, my child. And I wanna encourage you to tune out all the screaming voices and get your heart focused in on that still small voice of God that is spoken to us through his word and by the power of his spirit. And be fierce about that vision. Do not let anything distract you or deter you from the vision that God has for your life because the vision that God has for your life is exactly why God created you with all your gifts and talents, strengths and weaknesses, good points and bad points. God uniquely created you to fulfill a certain role in this world. God's given you a destiny in Christ and you need to be fierce about it because if you're not fierce about it, nobody else will be and God's purposes and plans will not be affected through your life. So be fierce about God's vision for your life and let's follow him. God bless you today.